Hello children. I hope you all are doing good. Today I am going to tell you a story about Bikku Bakkula. Lesson number 12, page 23 and 24. Let's see the lesson objectives. By learning this lesson, you will be able to Understand the story of Bikku Bakkula, how Bikku Bakkula gained merit, how should we treat our parents and elders, how should we gain merit. Bikku Bakkula was the Bikku who lived for 160 years. Do you know? Why Bikku Bakkula lived so long? Because he had gathered much merit not only in this birth but also in the previous births too. Do you know children? He was never sick and had never taken any medicine. Now, you must be thinking, how did it happen? There are many reasons for that. We should care for our parents, elders, father, mother, grandfather, grandmother and other elders too. We should look after them when they fall sick. We need to bathe them, give them medicine on time. But all these should be done with kindness, sympathy and love. This is the reason Bikku Bakkula could live for 160 years without any sickness. Now we are going to read the lesson. My dear children, shall we take our Buddhism books? Turn to page 23. Page 23. I am going to read it out. Keep your finger near the word and read it with me. Bikku Bakkula. Grandfather, can you tell us who Bikku Bakkula was? Yes, dear, I will tell you all. He was the bhikkhu who lived for 160 years. You know, he lived so long because he had gathered much merit not only in this birth but also in the previous births too. Dear children, do you know he was never sick? He had never taken any medicine. How did it happen, Grandfather? Samat asked. There are many reasons you should Care for your elders, mother, father, grandmother, grandfather and other elders. Now I am going to read page 24. Shall we all turn to page 24? Keep your finger near the word and read it with me and look after them in sickness care for them bathe them give them medicine and thus cure them but all this should be done with compassion kindness and love yes Grandfather, we will do good deeds, but 
Did Bikku Bakula do more than that? To live so long and healthy? Yes, I will tell you all. Long, long ago, there lived a Buddha called Anomadasi. This Buddha had a severe pain in his stomach. It was due to a puffed up pain in the stomach. At that time, Bakula was a good doctor. He brought the necessary medicine which he got from the mountains, prepared the concoction himself and gave the medicine to the sick Buddha with a lot of loving kindness and compassion. When the Buddha was cured, he wished, Thus I have cured this Buddha. I have done this with a lot of kindness and compassion. I have gained much merit by doing so. May the merit I have collected help me to be healthy throughout my life. May I live long with the help of the merit I have gained? It was this merit that he had acquired that made him the healthiest of the bhikkhus. Let us also Look after the sick with a lot of love and kindness. Grandfather, Grandmother, I will wash and bathe you and help you. Then I will gain merit and I will be healthy and live long, said Samat. Now we will listen to the story of Bhikkhu Bakkula. Long, long ago, there lived a Buddha called Anomadasi. This Buddha had a severe pain in his stomach. At that time, Bakkula was a good doctor. He brought necessary medicine which he got from the mountains. He mixed all the ingredients and prepared a syrup by himself and gave the medicine to the sick Anomadasi Buddha with a lot of loving, caring and kindness. When the Buddha was cured, he wished, Thus I have cured this Buddha, I have done this with a lot of kindness and compassion. I have gained much merit by doing so. May the merit I have collected help me to be healthy throughout my life. May I live long with the help of the merit I have gained. It was this merit that he had attained that made him the healthiest of the bhikkhus. So, let us also look after sick with a lot of love, sympathy and kindness. Then we will gain merit and we will be healthy and live long. I hope you liked the story and I hope you understood the story. So, what are the good deeds we can practice to earn merit? Indeed, we need to help our elders, parents when they are sick. So my dear kids, how can you help when your parents get sick? Give medicine on time, help them to bath, apply oil, make their bed, 
help with the housework. Here are some few things that you could do. But remember children, you should do these good deeds with lot of love and kindness. Then you will gain merit and can be healthy and live long. So, let us all keep practicing these good deeds as good Buddhist children. Today, we learned the story of Bhikkhu Bakula and we discussed how Bhikkhu Bakula gained merit and how we should treat our parents and elders. So now, let's see the questions. Question number one. How long did Bhikkhu Bakula live? Question number two. Why he was healthy? Question number three. How did Bhikkhu Bakula gain merit? Question number four. How should we treat our elders when they are sick? Dear children, please go through the video again and try to find the answers for these questions. Thank you.